some KBO games for Friday, April 19. Hopefully they all play today. Last three days we've been getting hit by DNPs. Uh, so hopefully they all play today. Let's get started. I am running a five man. I do have two favorite. Uh, yesterday's two favorite. One of them did hit. Uh, the other one chalked by a, uh, by a 0.5. Uh, so hopefully we do better today. Uh, obviously we got hit by the DNP, so it did ruin our slip. I am running a five man today. First one I'll be taking will be yesterday's prop that got DNP. I am retaking it, and it's still at the same 4.5 that I took yesterday. Uh, Felix Pena's hits did get bumped though. Yesterday's hits it was at 4.5. It did get bumped to five. Uh, so you can see the data is showing that Samsung Lions are going to get to Felix Pena. So his hits did get bumped. His strikeouts stay the same because that's about where he averages between 4 and 5. I'll be taking the under because I think Samson Lions are going to win this money line. So I'll be taking Felix Pena under pitcher strikeouts. That's yesterday's prop. Second one I'll be taking, I'll be taking it is Choi Wan Tai at 5 strikeouts. I'll be taking the more on him. He's been averaging six strikeouts in his past three starts. Uh, should be a competitive game going against the SSG Landers. Uh, his counterpart is Park Jun Hun, which is my next prop. And I'm going to be taking his pitcher strikeouts. And I'm going to be taking the more at 3.5. Last two games, he had five strikeouts apiece against uh, higher opponents in the LG Twins. Uh, the only time he did not hit, he only pitched an inning uh, just for the fact that he had six walks. So he does have some control issues. Uh, but I'm going to be taking his strikeouts at 3.5. And the times that he did get five strikeouts in both of those starts, he did pitch four and five innings. Uh, so he's a high strikeout pitcher. If he gets his innings in, if he can control his walks. So I'll be taking 3.5 to go over. Next up I'll be taking is a hits allowed prop. And I'm going to go with Choi Wan Jun. And he is at five. He got some push equity at five. He's been averaging six, six hits allowed in the past three games. Uh, going against the Key Womb Heroes should be competitive. Uh, the Doosan Bears do have some great hitters. Uh, so I think he'll allow more than five hits. If not, worst case scenario, it pushes. And my last prop I am going with is Daniel Castano. And we'll be taking his hits allowed to go over as well. Going against the first place team, this is a battle of first and second place. Uh, Daniel Castano's strikeouts is still at six from yesterday that got rained out. Uh, I'm going to avoid his strikeouts. I think this is going to push and not go under. I like his hits allowed going against the Kia Tigers. Kia Tigers is the number one offense in the KBO right now. Uh, Daniel Castano is the ace for the NC Dinos. He is one of the top two pitchers in the KBO right now. I believe he's undefeated and he has an ERA of 1.4. Uh, so, but I think he's going to allow more than, he's going to have a quality start, but I think he's going to allow more than five hits against the Kia Tigers. And that rounds out my top five. So we got yesterday's prop, Felix Pena, less strikeouts. Choi Wan Tai, more pitcher strikeouts. Park John Hun, more pitcher strikeouts. Choi Wan Jun, more hits allowed. And Daniel Castana, more hits allowed. My top two will be Daniel Castano, more hits allowed, and Park Jun Hun, more pitcher strikeouts. So pick your favorite. Please like, subscribe, and comment. Appreciate the support. Hopefully we head into the weekend with a double up, if not a perfect slip. See you guys in the next one.